Hi everyone, welcome to another installment of GeekFest. My name is Fani Renders and today on the show I'm going to quickly show you how easy it is to create your own custom snippets for Emmet. For those of you that don't know what Emmet is, it's a plugin for text editors and it greatly improves your productivity while working with HTML and CSS. So if you're a web developer, I strongly advise you to go and grab this awesome plugin for your favorite editor. So let's get cooking and check it out. Okay, so we are inside Sublime Text 2. It's my favorite uh, editor of choice. I've got Emmet pre-installed on this little guy. Um, let's quickly uh, take you through what Emmet is and what it does. So let's say if you want to scaffold uh, some HTML, let's say um, an unordered list with five uh, list items, each containing a class called my class and some text like hello world. Uh, you would write something like ul greater than um, lee dot my class uh, curly brackets hello world uh, times five now when you hit the tab key it creates html in front of our eyes that's the basics of Emmet. now this can this can become um, very complicated um, and the syntax can grow and grow and grow but it basically can do anything it's logical it can it, it, it can generate any html sometimes you want to create your own little snippets and uh, let's see how easy it is to create our own snippets um, I'm just going to type one. Let's say we want to create our own snippet called example. So if I type example and I want to press tab, we want to be able to create a, uh, a code snippet called example. So I press tab, nothing happens. So just to show you, there's no smoke and mirrors happening here. So what we want to do is you want to go to preferences and you want to go down to package settings, then select Emmet and go to the default settings. Now we want to scroll all, down all the way to a tag called snippets and then here you would see there is a uh, uh, example commented out called HTML which is obviously HTML's uh, abbreviations one called example so now let's go and comment this guy out and explore what it's doing so it's quite easy so the moment you type H um, example tab it's gonna go and create a HTML snippet like this onto your text editor Hit Control S to save and go back to test it out. So let's type example tab and it creates HTML on the fly, like expected. So uh, Emmet also, the customization also supports the, its own API in line. So you can, instead of just creating HTML, uh, complex HTML, um, writing lines and lines, uh, lines and lines of HTML in there, in the JSON file, it supports its own little shorthand in the app, so you can go create our own little um, list items we, we, we did earlier. So let's try it out. UL times, uh, it's, it contains a Lee, uh, my class times, well, maybe hello world. And um, we want, let's say, three this time. Now when we save this guy and press again and uh, type example tab we should see our previous example with three um, list items so typing example tab there we go there's a, a unordered list with three list items i see there's a bit uh, i see that there's a bit, bit of a bug with uh, one of them but i'm sure they will sort it out uh, a bit later but that's it that's the basics of customizing emmet you can go read up on the docs uh, they actually go into detail how to customize it even more, but this is the basics. Hope you enjoyed it and found it useful. Cheers.